Hi, my name's Dan Hallett, and I'm here at the beautiful Aru Spa and Salon in White Rock to host the 2012 Calendar Model Search. We have over 50 contestants here today who will be auditioning in front of a panel of judges for a spot in the 2012 calendar. Not only are they going to be featured in the calendar, but the winners will also receive a professional makeover by Aru Spa and they'll be featured in a professional photo shoot by one of BC's top photographic artists, Claire Reed. Later this year, the calendar will be on sale to the public and the best part is all of the proceeds are going to the White Rock Hospital Society. So I'm excited to go in and meet the contestants, but first, let's meet the judges. I'm here with today's honorary judge, Charlotte Phillips, who's on the board of the White Rock South Surrey Hospital Society. So Charlotte, thank you for joining us. Thank you for having me. <laughs> no problem. Can you tell us a little bit about the Hospital Society and what it does for the community? All right. Um, the White Rock South Surrey Hospital Society is a, um, a foundation, a society that helps people um, deal with uh, critical illness, um, bereavement and end of life. There are hospice um, societies all across Canada and, and the White Rock South Surrey Hospice Society um, provides services of support, um, spiritual, practical um, comfort at end of life for the residents of the um, Semiami Peninsula. And how did this event get started? How did you get involved with Aru Spa? Uh, I come get my hair done here. <laughs> oh, perfect. So I had, was chatting up with Heather about some of the things I'm doing and some of the ideas started percolating. I decided that it might be a, a great opportunity to um, participate in the community and um, also to help us raise funds and awareness for the Hospice Society. So I think it's a, um, it's a great uh, relationship that we have with Aru Spa that they want to help us out and and it's a nice idea, you know, the ha supporting people who are at the end of their lives or people who have lost people in their lives is um, part of life. And I think um, the philosophy of a room spa is um, it's all about life. I, that's one of the things that the Hospice Society does help people do is live the best life they can towards the end of their life. I'm here with Isla Chan, the general manager of Aru Spa and Salon. Yes. And how did this event get started? How did you get partnered up with the White Rock Hospice Society? Yeah, we're very involved in the community, so we wanted to do something extra special for this, this uh, hospice society. We're just closely knit with them, and we do as much as we can to help them out. But you're going to be one of the judges today. Yes. So what are you looking for in the models? Honestly, it's someone that can portray our vision and we have different symbols in Japanese that we'd like to have them portray. Oh, okay. So. Awesome. And Aru has a Japanese name to it which means life? To be or to live. Awesome. Yes. Well thank you very much. Thank you excited you. to get going? I am. I'm nervous actually so oh, you'll be I fine. Am. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. Oh. I'm here with the Aru Spawn Salon Manager Heather Fairley and she's also going to be one of the judges today. Um, can you tell me a little bit about Aru Spa? Um, Aru Spa is just a, it's, it's basically a place where you can come and have everything done. Um, you know, it's like one-stop shopping for your beauty needs. And as a judge, what are you looking for from the contestants today? You know, I think what we're going to be looking for is that, that, that it's not just about the look, it's about what they can offer. That feeling of that zen-like experience, what we're looking for, so. Yeah. Perfect. Are you excited about today's event? I am excited, yeah. yeah it's going to be fun. I'm here with Claire Reed, the main photographer in this event, and also one of the judges. Can you tell us a little bit about your background in photography? Sure. Um, actually, my background is design, um, and I started, I moved to Europe about, gosh, 12 years ago, and I started photography there. I started studying, and I moved back here about four years ago and carried on with my studying and developing and growing and competing. and. It's just kind of evolved from there. It's one of those things any photographers out there will know. It's your kind of, your camera grows out of your hand and you just do it because it's a passion. You can't explain it, it's just in you. <laughs> and as the photographer, you're going to be doing the photo shoots mm -hmm. with all the winners. I am. So what the yeah. contestants want to know okay. is what are you looking for? What am I looking for? Um, I really want someone who's comfortable in their own skin. I just want someone who really wants to have fun with it and that's it. Awesome. Well, thanks for joining us, and uh, let's get this started. All right. <laughs> so there we have it. Now the judges face the very difficult task of selecting the winners. So check next week to see who will be featured in a room Spawn Salon's 2012 calendar.